<laughs> hey, it's episode six. Yay. Yay. Complimentary government issued aerosol. Max is regal again. Play in America. Let's heat this mother up. <laughs> that was a, a great use of. <laughs> <laughs> it's a red light on the camera. Yeah. Sorry, little buddy in chief. I'm still thinking about our last case. That was Marco. Yep. Said it was working last minute stuff. Obviously a pseudonym, but for it's a good pose with uh, with Sam looking out the window. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> hey, I wonder what that date means on that box. No, that's not <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> that's also a <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty old news at this point, actually. Yeah. <laughs> it's not old for me, it's still fresh. <laughs> Sorry, Randy. Too soon. <laughs> Too soon. <laughs> Much like, uh, is it Sergeant Peanut, or what is it? Peanut Franklin? Peanut Franklin. Peanut Franklin. Peanut Franklin. <laughs> I love seeing a... I was really disappointed when this was a lie, by the way. <laughs> the first thing that, that Doug and I did when that morning thing came up was loaded up the language database and did a search for the word morning. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> a lot of people say morning, and not, not everyone doesn't say it. <laughs> I, yeah, my first instinct was to do a big SQL query and try to find it. How come there's no wire coming from the phone? How is huh? it working? It's a, it's a cordless. It's got a little yeah, antenna like sticking out of the bag. It's a retro cordless Come on. Phone. Cords are a problem. I never noticed that. <laughs> but the uh, White House phone also has no cord, which is also cordless, I guess. There's Leonard. <laughs> Leonard in the closet. <laughs> we started this episode with the closet door open. What that means. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here's the out. <laughs> and also uh, a slightly more orange credit. Yes, this is yes. orange. I am uh, Daniel Farjam Herrera. I do choreography and rigging and a little bit of animation. I'm Jake Rodkin and uh, I did some closing credits. <laughs> and, and opening credits. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Randy! <laughs> I am Tim Reardon. I'm an animator. <laughs> On Sam and Max. I'm um, Jeff Sar, I'm also an animator for Sam and Max. I'm Randy Tudor, lead programmer. I'm Doug Tobacco, I'm the web developer, and I did nothing at all on this game. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he made a move. You tested it. Uh, I guess so. What was the original title? title? Yes. There was another title. From, From the Jaws of again? Certain Bliss. Yes. Yes. And why did that uh, change? Yes. Because of controversy. It, no, it, it changed because uh, we didn't want to give away to people who would look at a box uh, or a website that Hugh Bliss was the master villain before they even or, actually found out who Bliss was. No, or look at the moon. Giving it away. <laughs> right. That's right, the icon was originally Hugh Bliss's face on the moon. I never noticed the uh, rabbit on the hubcap before. The what, the Max? The rabbit? Yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, it's a little Max head. It's always been there. Cool. It's branding. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're custom rims. That's like been there since the E3 trailer when there was the huge shot of it peeling out. I'm sure you're mistaken, but we'll run the spectrum analysis. Oh, and uh, the, the white suits was also were also kind of a last minute thing. Yeah. Was, was it Marco and you? It was me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here's the Horny. rub unicorn. Would you like to rub uh, our yeah. unicorn? <laughs> At least, at least it was animated not rubbing the actual horn, which would have been much worse. <laughs> yeah, you even did the rainbow on the, on the, uh, on the earpiece? Yeah. yeah. I don't like the way that looks, but that's okay. That's a good touch. There are a ton of... I love how he says, rub it often. Right. <laughs> there are a ton of good unicorn jokes in the game, so yeah. at everybody tries using that unicorn on everything. There are some terrible <laughs> ones. <laughs> there are some terrible ones. Yeah. They're funny. Max took care of back at the office. Mental abilities to be developed and popularized by Hugh Bliss. Listen, he sounds like Brendan in a second. One question: Would it work on wrenches? Yeah, a wrench is close. Interesting. <laughs> That's <laughs> <laughs> friend That's friend 100%. Yeah. <laughs> Virtually indestructible display case is a triumph. So that was a uh, hit the road reference, correct? Uh, yeah. <laughs> to wrench bending swearing guy. Showing it to be impervious to bullets, acid, high falls, pressure force, sonic weaponry, diamond tip drills, hurricanes, poisons, cynicism, and liquid night. Don't touch it. I was really hoping that list would end in wrenches when I first heard it. <laughs> Here, Max, hold this. 
I meant in your hands, but whatever. One moment. <laughs> supposed to frisk Here's everybody. Like Tim's favorite. Enemy. Yeah. <laughs> Tim had a lot of fun with this one. Oh yeah. <laughs> I wanted him to enjoy it and Sam to not enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. That's your boss. This is my favorite Bosco. I don't know how yeah, to talk about Bosco. Yeah. Mm -hmm. you <laughs> I love doing this animation. So sassy. Why is it so disturbing to see? This is the beard. It's <laughs> the the horrible makeup job. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Myra the earrings. Beard. Are those Myra's earrings? <laughs> With a green circles. Yeah, <laughs> they look like it. Do you have you both tied up back there? <laughs> hey, I was on a roll. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy environments. <laughs> yeah, after this episode, Kim was like, I do not want to see another rainbow ever again. <laughs> I think John said the same thing. Or a giant hubless head. <laughs> that was Marco's effect. With yeah, the it's static. weird that it, right like two days before the game came out, it turned into like the Death Star projection. <laughs> <laughs> This room was the most difficult we've ever had to do as far as cameras. Yeah, Pete did a really good job on setting it off though, I think. Yeah. yeah. He actually pulled it off pretty well, I think. It works. His eyeballs freak me out when he's transparent. <laughs> I like his teeth. Yeah. <laughs> I just think it's funny that his mustache and his beard do not have the green Death Star effect on it. And I'll try out this video game of yours. Prepare to suffer extreme. Randy, you want to talk about Tic Tac Doom? <laughs> yeah. uh, you know, it would have been easy to make a regular Tic Tac Toe game that, with an intelligent AI, to, but to make it stupid was actually a lot more difficult. <laughs> it's a lot harder to actually, you know, do what you're supposed to do. Yeah. <laughs> it's harder to lose. <laughs> and Jake, I like how, Jake I like the intro of uh, of the post-apocalyptic city. Yeah. I mean, oh the yes. horrible city and uh, the Tic Tac Doom logo. I love how he says "own" before you even start playing. Yes. <laughs> Is that uh, Stephen Hawking? <laughs> Actually, all of the cops are Jared. <laughs> oh, was it Stephen Hawking? No. Get him. I mean, it's Jared doing his impression of He was Stephen a little Hawking. too expensive to get. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what was that in reference to? <laughs> I love that animation of Max. Yeah, that's a great one. <laughs> was that... Did he actually say yes? I love his facial stuff in this one. Abraham Lincoln, so good. <laughs> it's one of the several vomiting animations in this episode. <laughs> there is actually a nauseous mode for him. It happens. <laughs> huh? Doesn't it? Yeah. From now on, we can make him nauseous whenever we want. We'll do that. And I can't. We do that in a <laughs> Whose head is that? <laughs> what? What? It's like... I think it's uh, <laughs> it started out being uh, what are the guys from Bone? Uh, Tom or uh, was it John? Oh, Oaks? John Oaks. I think it was John Oaks. And then mine changed it around a little bit. There it was. Let the barfing begin. <laughs> We've come a long way this is Marco's intro with Tim's uh, mid-intro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is the the ultimate cutscene. <laughs> yeah, this, this, this was a long one. Yeah. People of Earth. 
This is evidence that uh, that there should have been a little more time between production and design. <laughs> or design and production, I mean. I think that was a, a poof for John. Oh, yes. Oh, poof. <laughs> poof. Oh, John, uh, John Scro couldn't be here and he asked us to, uh, to say poof whenever there was a poof effect. So, is, get ready for that. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> get ready to hear a lot of that. <laughs> get ready to hear a lot of poofs. Yeah, poof poofs. <laughs> Touch me and you'll have quite a happy, angry mob on your hands. Not if we. Reverse the effects of the hypno beam. Yeah, during this animating this scene, oh, no, you did. Dave's big comment was, "Get him to float, float, float. I want him to float." <laughs> He's floating. He was very concerned about the floating. Going to drum roll, please. He just tears it in his head. <laughs> a little one in there, actually. Yeah. Talk about every part of you I don't like. It's like circumcision, but double the length. Hey! There's a poof. Was that a poof? That was a poof. That was a poof. There's one poof. Wait, I was gonna say. Oh. Looks a little cockeyed there. Coming up with all of his different poses was, uh, Great fun as well. Poof. <laughs> that was a green poof. That was a poof. Yes. <laughs> poof is my favorite character of all. I just want to lie in front of a TV till I die in a pool of my own slobber. Yeah, if they uh, if they make a Max toy and then make a second series, it would probably be the Blue Max. <laughs> <Yes. laughs> yeah, right. You pull in this tail. And then that would be the third one, is the, yep. the no stomach tail. <laughs> <laughs> I love how he has a cord. But, but you can attach the hats to it. You can actually right. take the hand off and, <laughs> and the stomach. Yeah, it's good that he has the weird, like, the classic cartoon, like, ham bone slice. <laughs> <it's always> right. <laughs> <laughs> Surprisingly, this is not uh, the most disturbing that Hugh could get. <laughs> oh, those lines were cut. Yeah, those lines were cut unfortunately. Erotic Hugh. Uh, yep. Oh, you know what? I don't have Hugh with his feet upside down in this video. I'm sorry about that. Hey, Hugh's upside down in this game. <laughs> it's like the best thing. I love you too. <laughs> We're doing with this stuff. I think we found one of your doppelgangers, little pal. We're all doppelgangers. Yeah, but Max can jump around the environment firing his gun in the air. Yeah, and Randy was happy about that too. <laughs> yeah, was was riding the roller coaster. This was. Oh yeah, this is a Jeff roller this coaster was, ride. This was pretty fun doing. Jumping characters should not be allowed to ride roller coasters. It's <laughs> generally a good idea. It might be the best idea, actually. Like, there's <laughs> the joke. It was a little too upset. Yeah. <laughs> Wait for it. No. And that's when you don't stand up Oof. on the roller coaster, kids. Your irrepressible desire to shoot at anything that moves. That's the spirit. Not me. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if I can get any reception for this thing here. Pasco Tech. <laughs> Great shot. Uh, cut. But, yeah. Huh? No. That, that one cut's still a little weird. That's fine. What? Yeah, yeah. A... What's the other buttons on Bosco's uh, remote? They don't work. <laughs> Sam, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Be the wrongest of all of those. Two poofs. Poof. <laughs> Poof. <laughs> TV and eating orange marshmallow peanuts. That is like a uh, gesture. Uh, yeah, so bad. I, I think it has, hasn't it? Or Max behavior. What's that? Hey, Max. Hey, Max behavior. Oh, yeah. In the manner of speaking, Hugh Bliss split you into pieces, so you've kind of been all over the place. Hugh Bliss. I hate that guy now with his phony smile and his artificial. Only I think that's funny, apparently. Self-righteous jerk. Good to have you back, little buddy. Time to get ourselves some good old-fashioned payback. And incidentally, save the world in the process. What are we waiting for? <laughs> Hurry, little buddy, get him! Hi. <laughs> <laughs> huh? 
<laughs> put this together? <laughs> I put this together. <laughs> this is, yeah, this was, um, Brendan kept telling me, you have to make it look like, uh, never had a friend like me. <laughs> That's a little ambitious. <laughs> we don't have columns of food rising up and <laughs> belly dancers running around. But that shot is uh, actually pretty fun. Yeah, that's the first time we ever get to see Sam, like, <laughs> blast things. Yeah. yeah. And originally, it, it, the shots were actually timed to the uh, Pulp Fiction um, <laughs> thing. <laughs> what? <laughs> yes. But then Bogan had hand animated it and changed the timing on it. Oh. And this is uh, John's doing, the bacteria, which looks very creepy and very good. <laughs> Again, Hugh has floating teeth and eyes. <laughs> yeah. And a mustache. And a mustache. <laughs> Oh yeah, and the gasping. Brendan's like, more gasping. <laughs> yeah, all Sam does is gasp. <laughs> oof, oof, there's one. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> That's a great line. We also didn't have anything of Hugh angry or evil, so we had to make those specially. Poof. Poof, poof. <laughs> this is Hubless as the genie from Never Had Fun with Me. The tie was a pain for this shot here. <laughs> yeah, you could try to get that right. <laughs> you couldn't act him at all because his head would clip through the tie. Yeah. I got excited. I've got a better idea. Yeah, we had to go through a brainstorming session to say like what kind of ridiculous things are is he gonna be doing for these Poof. <laughs> these intros. Hey, you <laughs> The death of Hugh Bliss. This was Jeff's cutscene. <laughs> and the chimp <laughs> sound effects are great. <laughs> the faucet suddenly appears. <laughs> I asked Dave. I asked Dave, why would Max drink you bliss? And he just said, because it's Max. Because he should. <laughs> exactly. I need to learn not to ask stupid questions. So. <laughs> oh, the thinking. There we go. Yep, there it is. Signature move. I promise I will do that again. <laughs> and the He's a little too happy with this. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> and this is all Jake. This is a work of genius. <laughs> Except, once again, much like the war song, it started off as me, and then secretly, like 12 animations were created for this by the time it was done. I, I think everybody had a hand in this. At yeah. some point. Yeah. Marco built the environment by cobbling it together out of the entirety of season one. <laughs> yeah. and, Who did uh, uh, the Randy Max? made it not blow up his computer and Kim drew the Max. <laughs> Kim did? Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. I criticize it over people's shoulders. <laughs> 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 and Bogan made the little, uh, the f little floaty Max. Did he do this? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, another one of these things where we had to convene and say like, are we actually going to be able to do this? <laughs> Inevitably it happens. Yeah, how many characters in this scene? Yes. The answer oh. is. <laughs> it also involves people like staying till 3 a.m. Yeah. Right. That's a great pose. We don't talk about that. <laughs> the David Lee Roth shot in the air. <laughs> They have such, they have a lot in common. <laughs> Simple picking our teeth. <laughs> the point. Yes, there it is. <laughs> Gotta have the point. Ooh. Nice. <laughs> this is where Jake goes insane. The run. <laughs> the run cycle. <laughs> Again. 
got an instant message at like three in the morning. Saying, I love hey, Myra. Check out this little like test I did. <laughs> the hairball cough. <laughs> well, yeah, nice. the, the song turns into this like double time Gilbert and Sullivan thing. Right. And all of a sudden, <laughs> it does all of a sudden turn into that. And then <laughs> there's the shower post. <laughs> that's, that's Saucy Max. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh, we can guess what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> the video went out for a second, <laughs> but that's, uh, that's yeah, to be him eating. hopefully not. For Is that the list of yeah, chimps eating? That's that's Angry animation. Max eating chimps. <laughs> yeah, that one was. Yeah, it, it was actually uh, <laughs> it's not good. Uh, it was Dan uh, came into my office and watched this, and he watched the first like forty seconds to a minute of it, and it wasn't until the. Uh, the teddy bear mafia guy was car surfing on the car that he said, Oh, everyone's acting like Max! <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy's read is awesome there. But, uh, yeah. That's okay, though. I know in my heart that everyone is Max throughout the entire closing credits. Well, the song is also saying it, so... The, <laughs> that's true, Daniel. Sacrificing their firstborn unto me. Also, I'd like to direct... Brendan wanted Max to hurt his hand. Ah, that's what that is. Yes. <laughs> hey. I love how you got the contrast of Max <laughs> punching the smallest character and Max punching the largest character right next to that each was, other. That was totally genius. A deliberate sort of like thematic uh, <laughs> thing. <laughs> brilliant work, brilliant. This is Sam's only shot in the closing credits. <laughs> But he's happy. calmly he's, uh, driving a bunch of it's people. It's what he likes to do. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Tough life being Sam in a Max, Max, Max world. The master of chill. <laughs> Peeper's eyes must be getting all dried out. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there's pet Brendan. <laughs> <laughs> And maxopresident.org, everyone should visit that site. Yes. Yeah. The best thing well, online, apparently. Hey! More running <laughs> animation. Max, 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 world. <laughs> oh, this is the best thing in the entire series ever. <laughs> the little moment here? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I swear that was a real one, that last one. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> that was season one. Yeah. Thank you.